post game from the Al McGuire Center with head coach Kyle Reckles following tonight's 85-80 uh, loss uh, to the Golden Eagles. Coach, um, that was a tough one, but I think you learned a lot from your team. They were right there the whole way. Yeah, it is tough. I mean, you, you don't want to lose, and especially a you know crosstown rival. Um, and hopefully, it's going to be a rivalry now. I mean, competitive games with Marquette. Um, they were just bigger than us. At the end of the day, we don't have the size that they had, and they pounded it in the second half, which was smart on their coach's part. I give her a lot of credit um, for going inside, and we had to make a, you know, we had to make an adjustment. Uh, went to a two-three zone that we have not practiced, um, but I think it really slowed them down. And I'm very proud of our team for fighting back because the last two games we've lost because we haven't fought back. Because when teams have punched at us, we haven't punched back. And tonight. I thought we played a full game. I thought we played 40 minutes of really, really tough basketball. Um, we got down by, I think it was like either 9 or 11. It was right in that range, and, um, and we brought it back. And we had a chance at the end to put ourselves in a position to maybe get a game-winning shot. A season high, 80 points for your team, and just nice balanced scoring. You had Ashley with her, you know, 26 uh, usual points, but you had Jaleesa with 17, Steph Koswitz in her first career start with 12, and uh, Linda with 10. Yeah, you know, I, I did think it was really balanced. And, you know, Ashley steps up once again and has 26 and um, with a team that's keying on her. Um, that's why Jaleesa had so much opportunities to get to the rim um, because they just they were jamming on the ball screens. They weren't leaving Ashley. And so Jaleesa just turned the corner. Um, and I thought she did an excellent job of getting the paint for us. Um, we've got some defensive things that we've got to work on. We can't give up 85 points, um, way too many points to give up if you, want, if you expect to win. Um, part of it had to do with just some of the turnovers that we had at the beginning of the game. Game, although we balanced that out towards the end of the game, um, but we've just got we just got to continue to build from this. And for our freshmen, this is you know a great atmosphere for them to be in. That physicality, they've got to continue to learn how to step up, um, and they've got to realize that you know in key games like this, minimal mistakes. So like one mistake can really dictate whether or not you're going to win the game or not. Speaking of the defense, uh, you did force 21 turnovers, scored 28 points off that. So despite giving up the 80. There were still some bright spots on the defense. Oh, yeah, and I thought our pressure was really good. I thought Jaleesa really handled herself very well against the pressure and then in return pressured them into making some mistakes. Um, we were after loose balls tonight. We were competitive. Um, we always say we want to have a contagious energy about ourselves, and I thought that our team had way more energy than Marquette's team. Um, I thought we competed for every single possession. The ball just didn't fall our way sometimes. Um, you know, and they we missed some key box outs in the second half. So for as much as we forced some turnovers, their offense the rebounds in the second half really, really hurt us. Well, Coach, uh, happy Thanksgiving. We'll uh, see you this weekend in Missouri. All right, happy Thanksgiving.